Well, fishing technology has become so efficient through sonar, they can detect schools of fish, and what way technology they can rake in thousands of fish with other fish and porpoises and other things they, which they kill. And uh, they took out more fish than the fish can, at a rate faster than fish can reproduce. So I figured eventually uh, they made laws that the, you can only fish in certain areas, that 12 miles out from the coast of this area would belong to that country. But the pinheads that were voted in the political office would license another country to fish in their restricted waters. So they sold out their country. You know what I'm talking about? It was no good. The monetary system just was no good, no matter how you package it. So what are these mariculture? So what we do then, I figured, we should have in the sea areas where we can cultivate fish, and they won't be swallowed right away by bigger fish, and then release them into the sea so we'd maintain dynamic equilibrium. Not just fish, but all the other materials in the chain of life, the web of life, that should be released. Seaweed, everything else, to build a balanced ocean area. Now, if you built a balanced ocean area off the Philippines, there'd be more fish, and people would go there and fish. So you had to have it on a global basis. I, I couldn't see it. Then I would picture, the, oh, the sea water would move through, because it'd be porous, but not predators. You know what I mean? So you didn't have to get in there and change the water like you'd have to do in a land-based aquarium. So I built my land-based aquarium near a river, and the river would flow through it. So it would constantly change the water, oxygenate the water. So what are these round things with the with the, uh... Different types of sea life. So, like, like in my hydroponics farm, it'd be stepped. So the overflow from this type of plant would be that what the next plant uses, and so the overflow would be constantly nutritionally arranged with plants that thrive on the waste product of the other plants, just like the human body. So they were stepped. Can you picture that? Hydroponics with water flowing down. And then at the bottom level would be that mushroom which survived on a wide variety of things. So today you have one kind of plant growing, and it goes back into the soil down under and doesn't do what I'm talking about. What are these things that we have pictures of that are the mariculture fish farm? Yeah, yeah, yes. We have different types of fish in different areas. So the waste product from one area goes to the other. And not only seaweed and all the other ingredients, it's a whole chain of things that fish depend on, not just one kind of fish. You have to put the fish in that support the fish. Like uh, the, there are fish that adhere to sharks, and uh, you have uh, you have a chain of line like the birds defecate, and that's very good for the soil, you know. And so in in human systems, we don't recirculate. Uh, toilet water, you know, we don't, we don't harness everything. And there's no profit in, in putting back into the ocean for what you take out, but in the long run, <coughs> it'll kill us. Greed, greed isn't greed, really, it's stupidity. When I use the term stupidity, I mean people are not appropriately informed. I'd rather not use that term because they're not stupid, they just don't know any better. So you, these, you know what I'm talking about? These areas, and these, these round mariculture... A uh, marine uh, designed would be designed in size and dimension uh, based on marine ecological studies, not fresco. Right. You see what I mean? I don't design these things <coughs> as, as, hey, this is a better way of doing it. You have to invite marine ecologists, biologists, uh, nutritionalists, all of these people. Now, how do you get the mercury out of water? You know, there's a So your water goes to a huge centrifuge, and mercury being much heavier than water. Uh, in other words, this is why I designed the undersea generators. They service many different functions. Will they get all the mercury out? No, but the water will be a hell of a lot better than it is. And just remember this, that the system that I propose is not perfect. It's not all things. It's just that we better get to work and start, stop thinking of money as the only means of moving forth, controlling the resources of the world, you'll kill yourself that way.